There's no way he would have lived if a car would have hit him going 25 miles an hour. He was in a plastic car. Good morning, guys, and happy Friday! Welcome to today's vlog. My baby boy woke up with no fever. He's feeling so much better. He's not running around laughing, but he's running around. He's having fun. He's way more happier than he's been. <laughs> and we're just so excited. Y'all, I just received our Home Chef and look at the amazing thing Home Chef offers. Again, hashtag not sponsor. They have Easter sides, so you can get the meat, but we, of course don't eat it so we just got the sides option and then i'll make some plant-based protein but look makes it so easy if you're having guests come over they offer this on top of the normal items that you're getting which is so amazing to me i freaking love home chef and these sides look amazing are you Yeah. No, it looks fine untucked. Okay, good. Because I'm not going to tuck it in. I don't care if it looked bad. Daddy is going to a work appointment all the way in Irving. Oh, you meant the white shirt. I thought you meant it like that. So it still looks okay? Yeah, it looks fine. So we meant the same thing. Yeah. Sissy's wearing a pretty dress. She picked it out. Grandma got this for her for Christmas. Oh, you want to say hi? Can you say hi? Oh. Say bye, Daddy. I love you. Bye bye. <laughs> Unwind. <laughs> Can you give Daddy kisses? Oh, so sweet. Oh, thank you. How are you doing? <laughs> He's like, yeah, here. Yeah. Take my hat. Give Daddy a hug. Kisses? Uh, give me a big hug. Oh. Kisses? Look, this try. Alright. Ah! Oh, you wanna say hi? I'm ready. One, two, three, say hi! Now Louis is leaving for his meeting and I need to pick up the house. We just have random things all over. Oh, double hi! <laughs> I just have random things all over the camera. I'm still getting used to when we're in a dark area versus a light area. It's a little too overexposed right now, but I'm working on it. The kids bring down random items and then my house gets dirty. So I need to pick up. Bye. 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 Okay. Oh, by myself. If I sound awful, it's the microphone. A few moments later. Because you have the most amazing wife. Oh. And I looked through five pairs of jeans until I found oh. it. I only have five pairs of jeans. I was cleaning all the floors and then Louis calls me and he's like, hey, do you know where my office key is? And I'm like, no idea. I don't ever have to know where it's at. Sorry, I take care of the four children. You take care of work and office. So he's like, I think it's in my pants. And so I went digging through the dirty clothes because I haven't done our dirty clothes yet. And I went to the bottom of the barrel, the fifth pair of jeans, and it was in there. And I'm amazing. Just, you know, a little shout out to myself. But I'm gonna finish cleaning these floors. I need to take the laundry upstairs. I got it all in the basket. I wanna get a nice basket to be able to load all the stuff up and down. Definitely not the blue one, but it's not on my like urgent list right now. One hour later. So it's finally time for mama to listen to Alyssa Rose's first freaking single. I'm so excited for her. She wanted us to film our reaction, so I waited until today to film it, but it was released last night at 12 o'clock, and I'm so excited. So this is my first impressions, my real raw reaction, and I can't wait. I'm so excited for you, Alyssa, if you are listening or watching this. No, I love you, and I'm so proud of you. Ah. You wanna listen to a song? Yeah. yeah. All right, let's turn it on. You want to dance? Yeah? He loves to dance. That girl can sing. Oh. Are you excited? Yeah? Okay, you ready? Let's listen.
Dang, girl. Keeps bobbing back. Like, give it all to me. <laughs> He's trying to snap. So freaking good. Your voice is amazing. Second of all, it's so catchy and the lyrics are just like on point. Third, I could definitely have that on repeat. Yay, we are so proud of you. Wow. Yay. Wow. Say go Alyssa. Do you know how to say that? Yay. We're so proud of you. Congratulations. Go like this. <laughs> doesn't copyright us. But it's okay, let's take all my money. I'll listen to this song. All the kids are up from their nap, so we're gonna go to the park and I'm officially going to take the new vlogging camera and test it out in the wind. So let's see how the new audio works in the wind. You're gonna push him? <laughs> the kids always go right up there and then they wait for me and then we cross the street together. I want to race you. I want to race you. Oh, they're going to catch us. They're going to catch us. They're going to catch us. Gentle tank. A few moments later. We had a little change of plans. I'll talk to you guys about it when we get home, but um, yeah, we're headed back home. Look. Nice. Whoa, good job. Showing off. Don't wanna have to wait tonight. Wait tonight. Bets are off. I'm gonna find my way tonight. Wait tonight. Won't you talk to me? Don't do that, Cam. You're gonna get grass all over your. Look, I did it. Bad news. Bad news. I have a pants on me. You gotta see this one. I have one. a screen. Ruins your pants if you do that. Well, what had happened was Tatum was pushing him and he was going a little bit too fast, so I told him to slow down with Lincoln. Well, he kept going too fast, not listening to me, and he let go. There's a little hill, and so right before the street, that little hill, it's like a little hump, that if you get going a good enough speed, you won't stop. And so Lincoln was in his car. All of a sudden, I'm walking, and I see his car just go into the road and they're it's like on a busy street the kids know that you need to stop they know they always wait for me and they always stop there i never have to worry about them now lincoln doesn't know the road from the curb yet we're teaching him that but tatum knows and so he had let him go and i just see my baby in his car go into the street hoping and praying there's not a car so i don't know if i have footage i don't know if i had it recording when i was yelling for him to stop. Flashback. End of flashback. And all of a sudden, I just see Lincoln's car go in the street, praying, running over there, thinking hopefully there's not a car coming. Thankfully, there was not a car coming. But there was no way we were going to the park. Tatum was coming home, and he was going in his room. And what I told Tatum, that my baby and his brother could have been 
seriously hurt. And if that would have been with a car, he wouldn't have lived. There's no way he would have lived if a car would have hit him going 25 miles an hour. He was in a plastic car. And so we came home, Tatum is now up in his room. I don't have any sympathy for that because right before that I told him to slow down and he continued to not listen right in that very second. And it was a bad decision on his part. He does feel bad for it, but I don't play around with stuff like that. I'm serious. So we came home, the other kids are now getting the chance to play outside. That's why we are back home and we don't have any footage at the park because this literally happened on the way there. Lincoln's safe, Tatum's safe. No one got hurt. Thankfully, there was not a car coming. And it's about that time where people start coming home and that road is really, really busy. There's a park there. It is an entrance to a lot of houses. One hour later. The lighting's a little bit off in here because it's like almost about to have the sunset. So it's like bright and right in front of my eyes. But I just made the kids dinner. They had dinner. Louis still not home from work. He had a business meeting with a couple clients. So he's at that. I don't know what time he's gonna get home. I tried calling him, but he didn't answer. So I'm sure he's still with his client. I just laid Lincoln down for bed. He was kind of starting to get fussy. I knew he was tired. He only took one nap today. So he's doing that. The kids are having chill time. I'm about to go hang out with them. We're gonna have our Friday movie night. I was trying to do the dishes, get that all clean. And then I have dinner ready for Lewis. I just made some bow tie pasta with some homemade sauce. It was so good, so yummy. 